Oh yes, we're doing this today. Anamorphs to bias, hawk form. Today on World of Stuff. What can we say about Anamorphs to bias? I won't be treading new already familiar ground. Yes, he looks like TJ Omega. Yes, he looks like he's wearing his Sunday best shoes. He and dress pants. Yes, this chest looks like it's in has one of those weird inflation things in it. And yes, he has the, what would be the bird claws. That would be gloves for anyone else. Are kind of stuck to the backs of his elbows. Yeah, this thing is just kind of. It just seems like somebody else designed this guy entirely, while everybody else was doing the main animorphs to be at least cohesive amongst each other. But oh, I found something out about Tobias, and I need to share it with you. So that's why this video is here. Hooray. Now, as I was saying for him standing out, obviously because he's made designed the way he is, he doesn't quite fit in with everyone else. Granted, that, that can be a good thing, given how the uh, animal mode feet can be peculiar to work with. So they probably were working on that presumption that might be a problem, so try and figure out another way of doing it. But this, but that's mostly just kind of the thing he does. <clears throat> Come on, Jake. You can do it. Jeez. <clears throat> okay, fine. Be that way. Now, an interesting thing about the heads with these two. Their hairstyles are remarkably similar. And, uh, so are for, for a number of the facial features. There is a difference, but that's just because the head does look a little bit bigger as opposed to, to on Jake, as opposed to Tobias, who looks like he not only slicked his uh, hair back with well, Crisco also looks a bit shrunken. Especially given how massive his shoulders are. Weird, but it's something... To, but it is a point of comparison now, isn't it? <laughs> Another odd point is that the articulation seems to be designed for the human mode far better than any of the other ones. But that doesn't necessarily mean that it's any good any. But as you can see, he does have a uh, head rotation, a ball, actually seems to be a stem joint for the shoulder, 45 degree elbow, waist swivel, so better than some, ball jointed leg, ball jointed hips, but doesn't go out that far. Oh, and that lovely creaking, let's see right now, pin joint for the knee and foot tilt. And what's weird is that, despite having such big feet, he still has a hard time standing, which is the one thing he's supposed to be able to do properly. Now, for that thing I realized about Anamorphs Tobias, you know that guy who thinks he's the hottest thing since the sun, thinks he's all that in a bag of chips, but he's really not? That's kind of this, the energy this figure is giving me. Basically, the kind of guy that goes, now, if he was did exist, he'd be going like, "Child, I must warn you about the Yurks and the scars they are upon this planet." Listen to me, listen to me. Yeah, that is a lot of M goes off a train, but I'm going with it, so deal. Now, one other thing that. You probably already know about Animorphs as opposed to Beast Wars, is that with the mass amounts of kibble that they have, because they're robots in Transformers, you could at least make it look interesting. With Animorphs, it's just kind of in the way. Or just creepy. This is especially problematic for Tobias, who's basically his entire backpack is as 
is his animal mode. Well, aside from this part right here, but you get the idea. Child, I must warn you all. Never mind my freakishly large backpack. Listen to me. Listen to me. Now, obviously, Tobias does have a mutant head here. Uh, yes, mid transformation sort of head. Flip the parts out, fold this down, and uh, you can have the, what will be the hawk mode with the beak or Eldritch Horror. Whichever you prefer. Child, why are you running? This is me, mid transformation. Listen to me. Listen to me. Now, well, since we're already partially through this hellish transformation, let's finish it up. We fold up the beak, fold down the feet, twist the entire half or half around, and bring it up to the chest. Yikes. Okay, then we will twist these down, bring out the, the claws, like so. Yeah, the fact that this is uh, supposed to be human is even, <laughs> makes this even less pleasant to do. Trust me. Fold this part out. Out. Let's see now. Can we bring this down any further? No, really? Okay, fold out the wings. Like so. And there we go. Tobias in hawk mode. Child! Gaze upon my alien form. Look upon it with awe and wonder. Listen to me. Listen to me. As for group comparisons, here we have Rachel and Jake again. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Scale, what's that? Right? But at least with the two uh, lion, uh, the lion and the tiger, they at least look nice. They at least look like they're, well, relatively speaking. The lion looks a little sedated and, yeah, that's just freaky. But at least it looks like I can, can, there's something there. Here, you can, the best you can do is do them in this perch and just kind of have them hanging out. So no matter what you do, device just kind of useless. Hey, why do you all wish me to live? I wish to warn you. Listen to me. Listen to me. Now, as far as getting one for yourself, uh, you could probably skip this figure unless there's something in this that really, really connects with you. Or if this was a figure you had in your childhood. My apologies and condolences. Or you want to have a decent laugh. Uh, you probably aren't going to find much to, to find interesting with this particular figure. Yes, uh, the a few accessories are pre-attached, so that's not going to be a problem. Aside from the Yurg bug, but people give and take that already. The uh, painting is competent, but it's only, but it's not complete. And both ver modes are just bizarre. So, uh, personally, <laughs> I found something I could at least laugh at for this. So unless you're looking for a good laugh, you're probably not going to find a decent experience out of this. Anyway, I am the Deceptive Wolf. This has been Animal Wars Tobias, and again, I remind you all, for your mind, for your toys, but in this case, you probably won't be putting this anywhere. <laughs>